Hey guys, in today's video, I wanted to talk through three potential fixes to fix your voice chat not working in Halo Infinite. I honestly didn't even know mine was broken until a day or two into the release when I realized I hadn't heard another player ever. So if you haven't heard anyone ever, then it's possible you're in the same boat as I was. Let's walk through from the beginning on how to get there and hopefully get you guys fixed and talking to your teammates and helping out for the dub. First step is to make sure your in-game is set up correctly and working. Hit settings, go to audio, make sure obviously all your volumes are up. Scroll down a bit and make sure that your voice chat input device is correct to your mic, as well as push to talk. If that's what you use, make sure you have incoming volume correct. Make sure your fire team, lobby chat, match chat are all checked and up. So this is step one to make sure it's working. And you can actually go into a game and validate that it's working. Go into a custom game really quick. Okay, so just hop into a custom game, switch to the scoreboard and hold down your push to talk and talk. And if you see the mic moving to the left of your name, then that means that you have it set up correctly for in game, but you do want to double check that it's working. And you have the right mic selected. Okay. The next step is to open up the Xbox console companion. So let's do that. All right. Open up Xbox console companion from your search bar. Make sure you're signed in. And then on the bottom left-hand corner, look at settings or left-hand side, I should say. Click on settings, scroll down. Now this did not fix it for me, even though these were incorrect. Um, I'm gonna show you what finally fixed it for me, but double check that these are correct. And I've heard that it fixes uh, the issue for some, for some players. So make sure that you have the correct speaker and microphone selected here with the volume turned on. And the last step, which is the one that actually worked for me was the Xbox game bar. So first things first, you wanna, make sure the Xbox game bar is enabled. So you're going to type settings, open up the settings app. You're going to go to gaming Xbox game bar, click on that. And you're going to go and make sure that this slider is selected on. Then what you're going to want to do is type it, type windows G. That's the shortcut to bring up the Xbox game bar, or you can type in Xbox game bar again in your search and open up the app. And then on the left hand side, you have two things here. You have mix and you have voice. Make sure under audio, you have voice and you have the default communications one correct and input and output. These two were not correct for me. And once I switched them miraculously, everything started working in game. That's it. Hope this video helped you out. If it did, feel free to drop a sub and I will see you guys in the next one. Thanks so much. Good luck in your games.